Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do your mid-July 2018 general reading. It's a general reading. It will not resonate with everyone. Please do not leave comments about it's not resonating, okay? Alright, um, let's save the announcements to the end. Let's get into it. Uh, we've got love and romance, career and finance, additional cards of support. We've got some stones laid here. Let's see. Looks like, firstly, right off, Gemini wants some truth and clarity in a situation in regards to money someone being cold someone being distant they just want the truth like do you, are you in or are you out um either someone wants this from you gemini or you want this from someone else uh my two love stones yeah that's distance there's distance between you and a partner. Now, this could be physical distance. This could be emotional, mental distance. Um, stability is here as far as mo money is, is concerned. It, that's not a heightened issue. The issue is there are lots of friends. A lot of you spend money with friends. You have fun with friends. You're trying to found, find peace and groundedness with the in a friend with your friends and in friendship situations but it looks like with love there's a big issue here the issue is someone being ice cold about their feelings um, just not forthcoming not upfront some of you could be traveling or you have traveled to a very nice place very beautiful um, Possibly with friends or or was it a group setting? Some of you are pregnant or you want to be pregnant. Some of you, um, yeah, the, the relationship, a love relationship, I guess, has grown, gone cold, grown to be very distant, boring. There's lack here. Not monetarily, but love. Lack and love. Okay? Alright, so let's jump into this. Some of you, if you get the truth and clarity you need, then you'll make the decision that you need to make either to walk away or to stay and work on it. But you just want to know. You want to know the truth. Alright, love. What do we have here? The Tower. The Three of Swords. The Magician. And an extra, an additional card fell out here. The Seven of Swords or the Page of Cups. Yeah, definitely. That's in the stone. Somebody wants truth and clarity. Somebody's being sneaky. Someone's ice cold. It could be a third party situation. There is either separation, divorce, the need to practice caution in this relationship. Because someone is highly manipulative. And their messages of love and wanting to invest emotionally elsewhere you could be dealing with a water sign cancer pisces scorpio another gemini libra aquarius like yourself scorpio um yeah it's it's rough here in love for you there's distance there's someone sneaking out the back door come through the front door sneaking out the back you know and that's exactly what they're doing here with the seven of swords and the page of cups this has been going on for a while. I think the final straw is when you get truth and clarity. Because we got truth here. And then we... And... Yeah. Oh, it's heavy, Gemini. It's real heavy. Um, The bottom of the deck for love, we have the Six of Pentacles. Sometimes the Six of Pentacles can talk about the inequality um, in a relationship. The imbalance. The problems in a relationship this could be your second marriage or second relationship doesn't have to be but um yeah if someone is giving more somebody's taking someone is or it's just imbalance here and it, it looks like it might have been imbalanced from the beginning because the tower comes in and breaks false foundations down okay all right career and finance bottom of the deck the king of clubs nice could be an entrepreneur, could be just someone who is, you know, really 
honing in on what they want to do, what they're passionate about, putting a lot of energy and time into self. Could have fire in your chart. Sometimes Gemini comes up as a fire sign. Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Ten of Hearts, Three of Diamonds. So it looks like in legal issues, career and finance, you're getting some good news. You're getting the you're at the highest level of happiness. Um, either in career, you're getting recognition. In legal issues, it's going in your favor. And it looks really good. This could be your lawyer if, if the, you are dealing with legal issues. Um, I don't see a full payout here. But it looks like you may be getting messages of things are moving in your favor. So that's really good. Bottom of the deck for additional advice from the Butterfly Oracle deck. Religion and spirituality. It's playing a big part here. Um, if you want truth and clarity, pray about it. It will come. Your uh, angels, God, whomever you believe in will hear your cry and will give you that truth and clarity you need. Don't wait for it for someone else. Someone else may never give it to you. But if you need it to make that move, um, definitely pray about it. Self-care. Lots of people are getting this. Uh, dietary change. Yeah. Um, yeah. Dietary change. Self-care might need to look at what you're eating what you're consuming um what you're putting on your body also and um if you feel like it's necessary make a change in your diet uh, but self-care is highlighted uh self-care is highlighted also i think it's going to give you some truth and clarity in, in regards to a love relationship too for some of you the news comes in that you might have an std or something of that nature or body parts you know aren't functioning in the manner that they should be um so it heightens your your um your senses in regards to you know well i know i'm taking care of myself but i am sexually active maybe i need to go enact some self-care with a physician and that might give you the clarity that you need that somebody is sneaking around and they're possibly not being as responsible as they need to be in doing this okay some of you are pregnant or um, there's a pregnancy scare you need to take care of that also with the physician um, congratulations if it's wanted congratulations if it's not um, I hope that this reading made sense to someone out there if not everyone uh, if you need to request a personal reading, my information is below. I still have the $5 one question by email um, reading if you want to take advantage of that. Okay, um, go over to my website. All the information on how to contact me is below, guys. Um, remember to stay in prayer. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care. Be positive, all right? Um, many blessings to you.